Hi everyone, we are back again with another wonderful information. As a matter of fact, today I bring you the latest about the teaching job recruitment opportunity in the United Kingdom. That is the 28th day of January 2023. Um, we had a latest update from UK talking about the area of or areas of concentration as regards the teacher or teaching job recruitment and um, it would interest you that as against what the government had said earlier they have come up with a better way to make it possible to attend to employments filed to them as quickly as possible so today i'm going to be showing you and as well telling you the areas you should concentrate on as um, a prospective and potential teacher in the united kingdom so let's get started the government of united kingdom has come up to say that they want a specified areas of teachers to come in there are teachers with specific specialism that they are actually hoping to begin the recruitment processes with and i'm talking about teachers who have the level six qualification that would qualify them to teach children between 11 to 16 years in the united kingdom where they are expected to teach science mathematics or language and of course the language i'm talking about here excludes english so if you are an expert in french german mandarin um uh spanish italian and few other languages as an expert you are qualified to take the short starting from the first day of february 2023 now another specialism that the training would the recruitment would begin with is mathematics if you are a math teacher an expert for that matter and you are interested in teaching in the united kingdom this is the right time for you they are waiting for your application please shoot that application immediately do not take chances now you have to know your onion you have to be a guru in your mathematics and you have to understand what it takes to teach children between the ages of 11 and 16 years then the last specialism they are looking at to begin the recruitment process starting from the first day of february 2023 will be the science um, experts so if you are an expert teacher in science please gather all your documents and file your application these three areas of specialism are where the government of united kingdom will be focusing more on until may they are going to roll out the next areas of specialism in may 2023 now let's talk about how you can file your application without necessarily sitting the IELTS test. A lot of people have reached out to me asking me if there is an alternative means of getting to file the application without necessarily sitting the IELTS test. Oh yes, that's the answer. There is. All right, so let's get started. How do you begin the process? of your NARIC, UK NARIC to be specific, you have to log on to the website. It is www.eccts.com. Just get that on your um, browser. You would see the registration um, button. So if you are there for the first time to evaluate your credentials, click on that uh, button, the registration button upload the documents, make the payments, and I tell you in less than two weeks, you've gotten your result, and that would qualify you without necessarily having to sit the IELTS exam. So here we go. Just a quick recap. Like I said earlier, the UK government have come up 
to announce that they will be concentrating on three specialisms for the recruitment processes beginning on the first day of February 2023. So what are these three areas? I talked about mathematics. So you have to be a specialist in mathematics and experienced. You must understand how to handle children, how to teach children who are between the ages of 11 and 16 years. And you have to, you must have obtained a grade or level six qualification to be able to get this recruitment. Now, another area is the science. You have to be a science experts for the grade level the level six qualification to teach children between the ages of 11 and 16 years and of course when it comes to sciences we are talking about the um the science subjects that children need to learn to prepare them for the larger or bigger picture of science activities then the last part of course i'm talking about language so you have to be uh, you have to have the specialism in a particular language. It could be French, Spanish, Italian, Mandarin, uh, Russian, and a few other languages, excluding English. Let's look at it this way. In the UK, English is their native language. So the need of or the need to recruit an English language teacher is not so necessary at all because the countries that have been found legible to come and teach in their countries in their country are actually not native english speakers so you can't be a non english or non native english speaker and you want to go teach a native english speaker their language so i think this is the major reason why it is excluded on the list of languages to be taught so if you have any question please drop them on the comment section of this video please feel free to share this video with as many friends and colleagues and family members as possible please do not forget to subscribe click on the subscribe button and continue to watch this over and over, we are always here for you. Catch you in our next video. My name is Ben.